Hello, and welcome back. Welcome back, shit nerds. The butt butt. We're gonna see butt butt throw down. Throws butt down. Justice and spades. It's time. Is it like raining acid outside? Yep. Well, it's the villain lair, so we have the green sky and enemies from like every zone. It's like scar here. Deception. Disgrace! Really? You had to reference that song out of all songs you could have referenced? Evil is plain <laughs> as the scar on his face! Oh, I sometimes even forget Lion King 2 is a movie. It was so much better than the first one. No, it wasn't! Okay, if there was any question that you were completely insane before... It has now come to light that you are completely insane. Well, no shit. I'm literally mentally ill. I talked about my time in an asylum on the fucking show. Like, do people think I'm just making that shit up or what? <laughs> hey, it's a red griffin. That's cool. Yep. Yep. Well, the asylum thing, you, you would expect them to you know, work... Otherwise, you'd still be in there, right? Well, as I think I detailed in that same episode, asylums suck. True. And yeah. the truth of the matter is that there really needs to be a better way to handle um, anybody with mental illness. To be fair, there's some nice asylums. Like, the, the nice newer ones that are just like old folk homes, basically. I suppose, but... Is that really an asylum, then? Uh, technically, yes. It's just not a high security one. Yeah. Because so, the the people inside are not dangerous. Then again, have you been to an old folks home before? Those things are still yes, kind of terrible. It, they, it still feels like a, a prison, to be honest. But still, it's a lot nicer. It's uh, very calm inside. Lots of people die there. That's all I'm saying. Well, obviously. <laughs> the entire purpose of an old folks home. It's to look after old people until they die. Oh, I went too far off the screen. I thought I had more room than that. That's like, oh, I don't trust uh, funeral homes because there's a lot of corpses there. Allow me to rephrase. I don't really care for old folks' homes because a lot of people die from malcare. Uh, well, that depends where you go. True. Um, Every place will have its own issue. And or lack of issues. And there's always the issue of, um, like, how, like, what quality of care, right? We know quality of care isn't quite the same thing. But, like, even if it's just something as simple as, you know, daily hair washing. Like, if you're giving, like, or if you're skipping that. Especially if it's, like, a paid-for option thing. That was tricky. Yeah, I did not <laughs> see that coming. Neither did I. Stay over there. Stay in your own hole. Bye. So what decides how much the save spot is worth for money? I actually don't know. Oh, these assholes. These are like cool samurai guys. Yep. They're technically jelly. Just like Fitz. So jelly. <laughs> You're doing it again. Shit! <laughs> Fitz is just gonna badmouth me constantly and I'm just gonna unsubscribe from Frybox. Uh, nah, there's lots of people we could be ragging on. I just prefer to rag on only people that will hear it, because talking behind somebody's back is some bullshit. So I said to him, when he was complaining about you the other day, saying that I didn't like some of the things he said, um, I said, well, once you're on, you can uh, start doing things back to him. And then he's like, no, I wouldn't do that because I have class. <laughs> so uh, there you go. There's, there's your rebuttal. What kind of class levels does he have? <laughs> well, for, he wouldn't rag on you. He'll rag on me. He just doesn't see it the same way. I will have to help. Good luck. 
I'm a pure and innocent babu. But there is nothing that you could hold against me. <laughs> Tell me what does babu mean, please? <laughs> it's just a. It's you just fucking like killed yourself. Yeah, it's just a cutesy way to say baby. Okay. Like, if you say babu, it just sounds like a million times cuter, okay? Come on, then. You guys think you're hot shit. Let's have some words about that. <sighs> so I'm looking to get a PS3 for sheep. For sheep? For cheap. Oh. <sighs> yes, for sheep. I have a few that I'm willing to trade for a PS3. Well, there's also some games called Sheep. I don't have those games. Well, you also don't have a PS3 yet, but apparently that's about to change. I, well, about to, nothing. What you talking about? You got plenty of funds to buy a PS3. Oh yeah, so much. See, my rule is I don't buy a new console till I've got at least five grand in the bank. That's why I still haven't got my PS4. However, once I have five grand in like nice, secured, not spending it next month on bills money, um, I can finally obtain my PS4. Not everybody follows the same money rules I do. I especially don't. You think five grand isn't nearly enough. That is true. Five grand would put me about three months. Because I spend, depending on, you know, income levels, um, my costs are about 1800 a month. I always uh, judge solely on income and never on what you have. The whole point of judging on what I have is what happens if I lose my job tomorrow? How exactly. long can I live without working? Exactly. And I always have a three month buffer. Because if I can't find work in three months, um, then I'm probably going to die anyway. And there's no point in having a longer buffer. Also, we live in Canada, and the government will take care of us for that. Because if, if we can't find a job in three months when I'm highly qualified and you're fry, um, we should be able to, you know, say that's the fault of the market, not, not us as individuals. And, you know, we have a market that's designed to support us in that circumstance. It's not entirely true, though. Like, lack of trying is also a constant issue. Well, I'll tell you what, if you can't get a job in three months, it's lack of trying for you. No, I'm just saying that there's not always... Okay, say you're ruling a country. Yeah. And then people are like, oh, okay, the market's not working out for us, we're not getting jobs. How many of them are lying and are full of bullshit? Um, based on the statistics in Canada, t um... 0.9%. 0.9%? Yeah. So that is roughly... Maybe 1,500 people? Where do these percents come from? Um, Stats Canada. You know Stats Canada is full of shit. Not really. That's why they're Stats Canada. I mean, the whole point of them is to give us these statistics so that we can, you know, judge it on things. Like, they, they measure the unemployment rate versus... Um, the actual market, and they let you know, and the truth of the matter is, there's not really a lot of open jobs. There's places that are selective on who they hire, and, you know, for good reason. Why is it so dark? Ah, uh, to dick it move us. This is a trapple. That's a trapple. It'll destroy a monster with 1,500 or more attack. Shush. Here it is. I take it you have to fight all the bosses again? Oh, however, did you guess? Well, Mega Man. But, but, stop your meddling and turn back now. This is your last chance. I will reach your black butt, even if I have to go through you. Shablam. This is your voice. Black butt, are you guarding my tower? Have you finally decided to join us? 
You may kneel and pledge your loyalty now. For the last time, I answered to no one. Very well. Here's a tiny taste of the power you spurned. Black butt. I warned you to stay away. <sighs> Evil black butt. He actually gets a badass phase. I'm trying to stop him from getting there. Ow, fuck. Nope. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, like I said. Badass phase. Nope, we're not. Meteors. Oh, they even have the smoldering rock left. Got him. He has a way fancier fight too, but I kind of don't want to have to beat him like eight times. For anybody else playing this game, you're going to enjoy this fight. This has gone far enough. Whatever you've been trying to do, you can't reach her. <laughs> oh, you may be right. She may already <coughs> be lost. But I can't let go of hope. By now, surely you <coughs> see who I'm trying to save? I do. Do you know a way to bring her back? I haven't tried anything beyond words. Her butt is too is so powerful. I didn't have the courage. <laughs> Go! Just don't hurt her, or you'll have to answer to me. Her butt is just too powerful. Her body too bootylicious, baby. Okay, that wasn't too long. Nope. Wanna just jump and do a finale episode that's super long? That was only like five minutes. Awesome. Super long episode, guys. Shop at night, but. Damn straight. We'll be all ready for this. Time for a badass day. Instant death. I was... <laughs> Called it. I'm gonna go lie down. Good night. <laughs> All right, time for some actual badassing. And the first level in Earthworm Jim was again. like absolutely like the first last level, mm -hmm. the first le phase of the final level. Jumping is very hard here. It's so ridiculously difficult. And those jelly ninjas are really cool. They are. Like, I wasn't trying to diss Fitz when I said, ah, Fitz is a jelly ninja. I thought he'd be flattered by the comparison. the honor jokes actually now that I think about it. Because you know Fitz always prided himself on that. I touched lava. And dead. Yep. Apparently you're not supposed to touch lava. Now we know. Important lesson everybody, don't play with lava. Unless you're playing Minecraft. At which point it really doesn't matter because you know You can put it in a metal bucket like it's nothing. Good thing my my spawn point is like right here. I'll still run the final boss and not buying anything else. Here we 
a dick. You're a dick. You're... It wasn't moving. You're a dick. You're a dick. It's like, oh, if you're going to call me a dick, I'm going to stop moving here. I wasn't talking to the platform. I was talking to the mob I killed. Well, clearly he got, you know, distracted by your dick joke. I'm going down. I'm Jimbo Timber. Woo. Fucking mobs, man. Jelly ninjas. I need to go lower for that. That way I have more room to work with. I need to go deeper. You need it to continue. Of course. After all, I still have an ego. There go. Waffles. There we go. Full health. Now that's the kind of potion I like to see. Now I want waffles. I have a whole like, fridge full of waffles, man. All I have to do is ask. Cunt! You fart flapper! <laughs> you fart flapper. you douche nozzle! You fucking turd king of shit mountain! I'm telling you to do. See, it just, it loves to fire that off. It thinks he needs invincibility. You better move. You better dance. Love this kind of level. Do you? Nope. Ah! Not dead. But will be. Damn it. He's not quite fast enough, I don't think. As we quietly watch. Hey, I've got to focus. You could be bantering. No, I'm helping you focus by not bantering. Somebody has to talk. Hey, Fitz, talk. What's up, everybody? It's Fitz. Oh, God. <laughs> that, <laughs> that voice attached to Fitz, Fitz's face just kills me. Is it Fitz's face with a little Fitz face sticking out? No! Exclamation! Ho oh, ho! Now this, this is rich. Who let this peasant in here to spoil our sumptuous supper? Hardly a surprise you've yet again set foot where you don't belong. We should <laughs> punish you. You're in deep now. 
We want a rematch. My new plans have no flaws. You can't win this time. A battle royale then? Marvelous! Who will go first? <laughs> Pass the salt. Okay, I like this. They're eating dinner. And you just kind of show up. Yep. Whee! I take it you have to fight them all in one health with the health bar? Pretty much. That's why I'm just being as bullshit as I can here. And again, propeller is the hardest, and guess who I started with this time? He's not firing cannonballs. Nope. I'm very grateful for this. Dead. Do you get health back? Yep, somebody will serve me a meal. However, I don't get magic back, which is going to make this guy way harder. Because let's not play like they don't know exactly which bosses I had the hardest time with. It's random on what the order actually is. That would be awesome if it, it did that, though. Oh, it would. Measures your health boss ratio. Got him. No more spikes. That was close. That was the hardest part. Honestly, I think this guy's one of my favorite bosses. He has a cool gimmick. He's just cool. Also, you keep jumping in front of his attacks. Yeah, but it's cool. Even if they don't give me, like, full health after this, I still have, like, a full health potion. Yeah. It's the magic I'm worried about using up. Got him. Okay, he did spawn in the platforms. I wasn't sure. Come on, then, you dick. He's way easier with magic, I tell you much. Hold still. It's right where I want you. No. No, you're moving again. Stop that. You're not allowed to move. Who's next? Tinker Knight! Does he get his huge mech form? Of course not. That'd be bullshit at this stage. Also, he's winning. Only barely. See, he's slightly more dangerous in his little form right now. Okay, so just so we're clear, in his little form, he's done me two and a half damage so far. Awesome. Keep track of my health bar. But there's his big form. Yeah, I know. I'm always talking with you. He's only done me half damage. One damage now. One full damage he's done me. Oh, one and a half. Two.
He's officially more deadly in his little form than the big form. <laughs> As he did me vastly more damage. Now eat your food. Oh, damn it. The full Molotaria here kills you. I'm really scared of Molemite. I don't know why, he's just never been that much of a threat. He's invincible. That lasts a while. My computer is getting excited. Yep. Well, this is probably the most intense part of the game. That'd be like some good boss rush. Ugh. Do they? Yeah, apparently. Got him. Smack that. Okay, it's King Knight. So, is it a random order or is it always? It's set? random order. Plague Knight's busy enjoying his uh, wine. No, his uh, the bendy straw. Ha! <laughs> it's true. He has a bendy straw. There we go. I refused to put effort into King Knight. I was just down hopping the whole time. Hey, buddy. We're gonna play a game called Go Fuck Yourself. You can be out of magic before it's done. Oh, I know. But I want to save my magic for being able to actually hit him a few times. Because this guy's actually... Mm, with limited control, he's probably more dangerous, but I have a health potion, so I'm not scared. When I've got more magic, though, he's a lot easier. Oh, he's gonna detonate them. That worked out. That worked out nice. Gotcha. There we go. Da -da -da -da! You have defeated them all again. Yep, now look at this. In the order I beat them. Yep. I like it when Tinker Knight's first. You can now leave them or save them. Of course I'm gonna save them. Doomed hero. <laughs> That's not, you only get this text <laughs> if you're wearing the nice. gold armor. My defeat is of no more concern. The enchantment's never stop any immortal. Strength to you, but I am still far more clever, so watch out. How invigorating, how uplifting. If all your quests are this much fun, I should go with you. There are substantial inadequacies in my hydraulic actuators. A considerable iteration of warranted. I meant what I said. You should still join us. All right. And now, the real final level. Oh, damn it. The Enchantress herself. Are you ready? Uh, nah. But let's go. Are you ready? No. Let's do it. All right, then. Be prepared for the long-ass level of death. It's how I always learn my jobs. Oh, my God. At work. You're like, okay, you can handle it, right? We're going to leave you here by yourself. That's how I've always learned. So the very tower itself is trying to kill you? Yep. Oh my god! It's the Abyss from Dark Souls. You wouldn't know about that because you're not far enough.
Oh god. Welcome to hell. Population. Please look how short this you. level is. Yeah, but how much of a pain in the ass is it? The most. This is the most pain in the ass. These platforms appear in proximity? Yep. Okay, I thought they might be time based. Which would be ridiculous. <laughs> Just watch, walk gingerly. Like that. The bunny hops help. Because it doesn't matter how high up in the screen you are, the platforms will still appear. Okay. And then there's just like two that are missing right there. <laughs> Alright. Here's the boss. It's a beautiful night, isn't it? Shield butt, come with me. Let us leave this place. How pitiful clinging to false hope, chasing ghosts. So have you come to slay me, but to avenge your beloved? Gaze into my eyes, see how fearful I am. Watch me cower as you draw your blade. I don't need a blade to fight evil, shield, but I know you aren't lost forever. You haven't the slightest hope of defeating me, but I won't stop you from trying, so please... Let us dance together into the abyss! Survive, please. So how many phases does she have? Uh, it should just be the two. There's death. I didn't expect it to fall. Hello, death. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I need 420 seconds. I'm sorry, I have 4 minutes and 20 seconds, which is not the same thing. For what? Um, before I have to pick up my phone and uh, text my wife to remember her medication. Ah, oh, okay. I thought the apocalypse might be coming. Oh, pff, no. When the apocalypse comes, I won't be giving you a warning. Well, I'm not on your phone. Fuck! Oh, she a bitch. But she's shield butt. Is she? Sort of. You gotta be nice to her with your spade of destruction. I wonder if Danny's gonna bust in the door and yell something random. When does he ever do that? Wow, I killed myself again. Great. He hasn't. But that's the perfect time to strike. Just waste a little bit of mana because who cares? Don't come crying to me when you, you run out of mana just in time for you to need to succeed. I'm going down. I'm Jimbo Timber. Come on, do something interesting.
getting very precarious. Well, on that side, yeah. It's getting very precarious. Right there. Because the benefit is, it recreates the sand blocks when she does the fire one. Oh, it does it. Yep. Neat her. She could just easily kill you by getting rid of all of the sand blocks. She doesn't want to do that though, it's not as fun. Don't you know villains are dumb? Bitch, please. Alright, let's see what happens. What have been practicing for all the game? You can't pick it up. You're like, oh shit! Start turning around. You caught me. If, if only, only I had known, I would have come sooner. Sorry, I'll do shield, but you can do shovel. You knew I was still there, even though it seemed hopeless. You never gave up on me. I will never give up on you. I will follow you to the end of the world. It appears that maybe you have. What's happening? Oh no, when the amulet shattered... The butt within it was released! Oh, oh god! It's already gathering! It will escape and wreak havoc on everything! Unless we stop it. Unless we stop it! We can restore it for good, here and now! But we're both weak from battle. I've never been more ready. Come on, butt butt! Let's fight together like old times! Now, stay close to me! She is, like, ridiculously useful for Shield Knight. They are obviously, like... They've obviously been doing this for decades. <laughs> um, pause. Tap to snooze. Sorry for the pause in the middle of the epic fight. Aww. Love that propeller. Oh! Bitch, please. It's over, but but this place is falling apart. We have to get out of here. Let's go. I know. Uh... Shield butt! Black butt! Thank goodness you're here! Butt butt is wounded! Take him and get outside! No! I can't leave you behind! How will you escape? This butt is too strong! I can't hold out much longer! Run! You can't deflect it! It will tear you apart! I'm so happy! I got to see you both one last time! Shield butt! Go! Take Butt Butt! Save him! Promise me you'll save him! Saving. Thank you, Saving Icon. Townsfolk rejoices. I like how this frog is disappointed with this frog. Alright, that's our show. So, what'd you think of uh, Shovel Knight, Fry? It was interesting. King Knight is cleaning the floor. Yep, they turn him into a serpent. There's Triple Pond. I think it's pronounced treble. Probably. 
Because it's trout and apple. I like trouple. Sounds better. Spectre I like babu. Babu boo. They're playing games together. The life of the party now. <laughs> they're good now. Or they're being put to work. It's one of the two. Iron Whale, Treasure Knight. They're stealing his shit. They're taking back all his, the stuff he stole from everyone else. Yep. Ill-gotten gains reclaimed. Explodatorium, Plague Knight. Mm -hmm. advanced, so he's a teacher now? Yep, advanced potion class. Lost City, Mole Knight. Excavations and Expeditions. So they're just treasure hunting? Yep. With horsemen. The Wandering Travelers. Always ready for battle. They formed their own hero party. Oh, Hat Knight. Flying Machine. Propeller Knight. Living the life carefree. Let's just... Just hosting parties and galas. And Everybody loves him. Blockwork Tower. Tinker Knight. I'm creating an army of death to destroy all. Probably. Toys for the children. Aww. Same thing, really. Yep. See, I told you it would be a great toy. <laughs> it really is. Stranded ship. Polar Knight. Oh, I was hoping he was making snow cones or something. Nothing. Nope, there's nothing to do for his lost honor. Safe at last. I kept my promise, shield butt. Rest well, butt butt. Until we meet again. In front of your blazing inferno. Well, and here do, we are. Do, do. So is the credits? Yep. The credits. Okay, so. How I can speak to them. Yeah, that was pretty good. That was yeah. really good. I like this game a lot. I think it's definitely like a good callback to some of the older era games. Lots of people worked on it. There were a lot of Kickstarter backers. But that was like the whole credits they just skimmed through, basically. Uh, very Mega Man esque. Um, very Mega Man esque, yeah. Uh, a little bit of a Castlevania vibe to it at times. And that was kind of it. Sorry, it was eight. Total deaths and best treasure haul per map. The boss designs were probably the best thing. And the total times per level. The music was great, even though I turned it off so you can hear us. Yeah, don't worry. Um, if I can convince Fry to do it, we're going to have a, um, a link to a few of the different soundtracks for you to sample on YouTube and their purchase on iTunes. Down in our... You can also buy it on Steam. Below. Oh yeah, you can also buy it all on Steam. Um, they have a remixed track that has some really good audio to it. I think you'll really like it, guys. Um, check the links down below when this video goes up. This was four hours and about 20 minutes of playtime. Total light inclusion, 77% because it skips some shit. Yep. All right. Thank you for playing. Produced by Yacht Club Games. Thank you, Yacht Club. Call us. <laughs> nah. I don't just call us. And say hi. Yeah, that's a good idea. Or send or leave a comment. And after the after credit scene, or tell us how much you hate us. She lives. She's back from out of space. And then she lands in the fire. <laughs> no. She curls up with Shield Knight, and it's the end of the game. Duh. Is my answer to that. I could be so show, guys. Like right next to each other.
Like they're, they're like little eyes, right? But why are they so close to each other? They're watching you. There's a bunch of them. Goodbye, everybody. Wait, what? That was it? Yep, that was it. Uh -uh. Bye.